And now let's get right to Joe Vasquez, who's at the San Francisco Hall of Justice tonight with late developments about a man about to be released. Joe? Can family members tell me a man named DJ Williams about to walk out of the San Francisco County Jail? Three days ago, he was near his home in the Mission District when police used force to arrest him. His hands are in cuffs, his face bloodied. This is cell phone video of 21-year-old DJ Williams as he was arrested Friday afternoon. DJ's family and the cops agree with this, that he was riding his bicycle on the sidewalk and didn't obey officers when they ordered him back onto the street. But what happened next is in dispute. DJ's family says he was listening to music and simply didn't hear officers, so he kept going. And that's when a handful of cops used force to put him in custody. One choking him, one putting all his weight on him, leaning on him, and the lady over there trying to put the handcuffs on him. They hurt him pretty bad? Yeah, they did. And he started beating on him for no reason. <laughs> Police tell a different story. They say undercover officers ID'd themselves, flashed their badges, and ordered DJ off the sidewalk. And when he didn't comply, they decided to arrest him. They attempted to detain him. However, he became combative and resisted arrest. The situation escalated as bystanders yelled at the cops to let people go. Officers threw the cuffs on several others as well. Hey, bro, let me see your face. Let me see your face. I can put it on camera. At least one other man appears to have blood on his face as he heads off to jail. San Francisco police insist that the force that was used was appropriate and that people should consider all the circumstances, including those that happened before the video was shot. Now, the family insists that this was excessive force. They've complained to the police department and they are planning a rally back in the Mission District tomorrow at 5 p.m. Reporting live, Joe Vasquez, KPIX 5.